Welcome to Market Board Videos. Today's video is on significant figures. Significant figures is one of those things that students tend to struggle, struggle, struggle with. They have a really hard time with it. Well, I have to tell you that I have a few rules that if you follow them in order every single time, you will never get a significant problem wrong. We call them sig figs. The first rule for significant figures is that all non-zero numbers are significant. So what do I mean by that? I mean that if we have the number 1,234, they're all non-zeros, they're four sig figs. Each one of those numbers is significant. Rule number two, zeros between non-zeros are significant. So what does that mean? If I had 10,234, there would be five sig figs. Although this number right here, that zero, is not a non-zero. It is between non-zeros, so it is significant. Rule number three, zeros at the beginning of a number are not significant. They are simply placeholders. And what do I mean by that? If you saw the number 000, 1234, these zeros are at the beginning of the number, so they are not significant. You have four sig figs, not eight. What confuses students frequently is when you have this, 0 0.01234. Don't worry about the decimal at this point. If the zeros are at the beginning of a number, they are not significant. This number has one, two, three, four sig figs. And that's that. If they're at the beginning, they are not significant. So that leaves us with the zeros at the end of the number. The zeros at the end of a number are sometimes significant. Oh my gosh, what does that mean? Well, that means there's another rule. Let's call it A. If the decimal is visible, if you can see it, the zeros are significant. Now notice, I didn't really say where the decimal was, I just said if it was showing. So if you have point one two three four zero zero zero, those zeros are at the end, the decimal is showing, they are significant. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, six, fix. Does that make sense? I hope so. What happens if I have the number 1,000 with the decimal afterwards? The decimal is showing. Those zeros are at the end. The decimal is showing, so I have one, two, three, four, six figs. Which only leaves us with one more thing to talk about. And that is, if the decimal is invisible, the zeros are not significant. I can't write today, but that's okay. You can read 1,000. That has one sig fig. Why? Because the decimal is invisible. You do not see it. Okay? The most important thing when doing significant figures is to take these rules and start with rule one. Because what happens is, People will look at this number and they'll say, but the decimal is, is, is there, so that means they're significant. No, because this rule says zeros at the beginning of a number are never significant. And if you do these in order, the ones at the beginning of a number are wiped out before you ever get to the decimal. So as you work through significant figure problems, make sure that you use these rules in order. 
Let's do one more problem. 076.32090. How many significant figures? All non-zeros are significant. So we know those are significant. Zeros between non-zeros are significant, so we know that's significant. Zeros at the beginning of a number are never significant, so that is not. And zeros at the end are sometimes significant. If the decimal is visible, they are significant. So this number has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven sig figs.